Hello everybody, my name is Rojo and welcome back to Wizardry 7 Crusaders of the Dark Savant. Last time we, uh, well, we were yonderly over in the, um, Oak Pier Mountains area slash maybe which mountains, hard to say exactly. Um, but we came across a cave and we got ourselves a one majestic wand. Um, don't exactly know what that's for yet. We saw another one of those, uh... Mixed creatures. <laughs> I think I called it a sphinx last time. I don't think that's quite what it is. Maybe it is. Um, but yeah, some kind of creature, kind of like when we uh, got high in the uh, the void. <laughs> and uh, yeah, she gave us uh, some insight to a riddle that uh, I don't think we've heard yet. <laughs> uh, unless she's talking about the maps, which we actually, you know, we, we have these maps. We haven't really heard very much about them. Like... Yeah, I don't know if we've ever gotten an overarching explanation of like what these are for <laughs> at any point in the game so far. Um, but you know that's fine. We're gonna go ahead and we're gonna we're gonna move along here, get away from the cave. I I also did go back into the cave and try using the wand where we picked it up, and uh, nothing happened. So, uh, just uh, wanted to mention that. I think we gotta go this way to get out of here, and then. We can go north, or we can go uh, get bent, I guess. North it is. <laughs> what do we got? We got bugs. We got, uh, we got a lot of bugs. Let's, let's go ahead and hide from the bugs. Still looking for three flowers. Um, I imagine we'll find them in this area. Before too long here. Actually missed another square down there by the looks of things. We'll, uh, we'll go back and check that out in a sec, maybe. Uh, Alright, so dangerous enemies here are the bear weevils for sure. So I think what you do is, uh, let's do this. Give me a haste. And then we're just going to do uh, a few rounds of sleep spells to maybe just make our lives ever so slightly easier when dealing with all of these critters here. Try something like that. Might not get them all because we're not casting it at a super high power level here, but it seems to be going pretty well so far. Okay. Now that that's done, I think we can kind of just go through here at our leisure. Uh, you know what? Give me a... Uh, just give me a little one of those. And one of those. Alright, easy enough. And now we can just go down the line. Oop, except for... You gotta go that way, okay. Punch those bugs. Nice crit. Problem solved there. Probably do a little bit of healing after this uh, fight is over. One more group after these guys, and uh, we'll be done with this. Should get the, you know, a little okay amount of, of XP. A few thousand from these guys, I would imagine. Mostly coming from the, the bear weevils, I, I would think. a few thousand. Yeah, that's pretty good. Alright, let's go ahead and just heal up a little bit here real fast. Just, uh, because we took a fair bit of damage there. Okay. Alright, let's just go double check this one square that's, uh, missing. 
Just got to make sure there's no path there that I'm walking by. And now we are good to uh, continue our exploration. Just like so. Except uh, there's, uh, there's nothing else here. <laughs> okay. Well, we did lose all of our buffs. Let's, uh, let's do a quick rest here. May as well. Okay. Uh, I'm just going to do a uh, detect secret just in case here. And let's just double check. Just, uh, yeah, nothing there. Okay. So I guess we got to go back a ways and uh, pick a different branch in the path. I think there's one over to the south here that we can check out. If we go back over to the left here and then go north. What do we got? A lot more more weevils. We'll, uh, we'll do the same old song and dance, I guess. Except this time, eh, maybe not quite so much with the sleeps. We might just might just fight him, more or less. Okay, um, yeah, we'll take out the bear weevils first. Uh, we'll just do a quick one of those, and we'll do a quick uh, one of those. Oh, bear weevils have quite a, quite a bit of HP. I'm really going after Alima there. I guess maybe she's the only one revealed. Oh no, I guess Gertrude was too, but yeah, either way, it's fine. Okay, got a group advancing here. What do we got? So we're going to want to go after these guys, I think. And then uh, we'll just put these guys, these other Venom Weevils here to sleep. For next round, should make her life a bit easier. God damn. Even the boar weevils are doing damage. And poisoning. I did not know that they could poison. I thought that was more of a venom weevil thing, but uh What you gonna do? Alright, lots of crits on that uh that section there. Now we finish them off. Don't mind fighting the, the bugs here. They're pretty easy to deal with compared to a lot of the other sh shit that we see. <laughs> and a lot less tedious than, like, moths and stuff. Look at that XP. Yeah, because the moths, uh, just cast so much garbage at you. Alright, cure your poison if you can. Possibly do a big heal on yourself. And uh, you're actually maxed out, so you should probably be doing some healing as well. Okay. Oops. Saving in the wrong slots here. My bad. Not that big of a deal. We're not that far away. Uh, but still, let's not save an entire game or entire session's worth of play over the uh, the old save game. So I think we can go up here, maybe. Get uh, somewhere. If we take this path here. I've already been here, I guess. But it seems like I didn't explore it all. Okay. <laughs> two Turker trees. Let's just fight them. There's only the two. How hard could it be? What could possibly go wrong? Etc. Etc. We'll try a poet's loot. I don't expect that to work. It did work, actually, kind of. Oop, alright, well. <laughs> they died a little faster than I thought they might. Not going to complain about that, though. Alright, let's mosey on around this way, and we'll just see what we can find. Dragons. Oh, no, rock wizards. Okay, good. Much 
better. All right, we'll go ahead and just do an angel's tongue on this one. Might take two rounds to get through these guys. The way things are going here. Yep, that's okay though. We can uh, we can make that happen. Maybe we don't even need to worry about the haste and the the angel's tongue for uh, for these guys. Might be able to just fight with everybody and call it a day. Ooh, a samurai level. A little vitality there. We'll take it, I guess. Um, yeah, you'll never use a shield, but have the skill anyway. We'll max out your scouting, because we can, and then uh, give you a couple more points of climbing here. A few more points of power strike, and uh, I guess... Was I working on our thaumaturgy now? I feel like maybe I wasn't. Eh. I don't know. I don't think it matters too much. We may class change her again at some point, but not right now. Oh, whoops. That's the way we came. My bad. Right this way, though. Okay, that's just a nook. Nothing there. Yeah, nothing there. Uh, there is something here, though. Yeah, okay, so I did explore this way a little bit, I guess, at some point, and then I just decided I was going in the wrong direction at the time. And I uh, came back this way, I guess. Okay, I guess we'll try this way first. Gonna get our detect secret back up. Oh boy, many bugs. That's all right. We can we can handle many bugs. Probably some bear weevils in there somewhere. Just based on how these other fights have gone recently. Yeah, there we go. So we'll just uh, we'll just fight these guys like so. Do one of those. Do one of. These and then we'll call it a day. Missed one of those boar weevils with the loot there. Uh, okay, yeah, we'll just uh, let's fight these guys. And uh, we'll just go down the go down the list here, I guess. Good stuff. Ooh, venom weevils advance, do they? That's fine. Uh, just fight, 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 and put those guys to sleep. Easy enough. All right, last group. Quite a bit of XP uh, <laughs> off of these bugs out here. But uh, no flowers. Let's, um, let's actually get another one of those going. Just so we have it. Well, this keeps going for, uh, for quite a while, doesn't it?
Okay, moth time. Um, what if we... What if we did like that? Not that. What if we... What if we, what if we did something like this? And then you just fight them. And you fight them. And then you maybe just put these guys to sleep. Like that. What if we can asphyxiate moths? I don't know if I ever tried that. Yeah, it seems like it was working pretty good. <laughs> Nuclear blast, that is. We got all this fire magic, I haven't really been using it on anything, and I don't expect necessarily that we're going to have any super serious fights. Or at least not a lot of super serious fights, uh, while we're finding these flowers, so... We can speed things up maybe a little bit with some magic here and there. In the meantime... Let's, uh, just keep on... Moving on here. Hey, there we go. We stand at the base of a sheer cliff, almost straight up, and certainly impossible to scale or climb. It appears to ascend all the way into the heavens. Mm, does it now? Search. Nothing. Um, what if we were to do like one of those? No. Okay. You got me. Nothing uh, Nothing to be done here, I guess, right now. I imagine we're intended to fall down that later, maybe. <laughs> I'm not sure. Uh, for now, we can go... Not there. But here looks like there's uh, a little something, maybe. Just explore that, I guess, real fast. And, uh, yeah, we'll try going this way instead. Okay. Couple lizards, I think we'll just swing at these guys. That should be fine. Might be Komodos since there's only the two of them, but probably better just to hit them than to hide. Alright, easy enough. Surely there must be some more flowers around here somewhere. Oh, okay. Three, you know what? Three two-headed lions. Let's uh, let's hide, just uh, just in case here. Ow! Ow! Okay. And now we do battle. And we'll just uh, do one of those, and we'll do one of those. I think that should be sufficient here. And just more Bentari. They can crit us, so we're going to be a little bit lucky here, I guess. It's not a high chance, but it can happen. I guess theoretically there's also less of a chance for them to crit us now than back when we first saw them, because we're... Higher level. They are with an absolute ton of XP, though. You'll love to see it. Ah, perched com comfortably underneath a thick arm of a tree, a white blossom dangles in the breeze. Pick it. A stinky odor shoots from the blossom when you grasp it after a few whiffs. Suddenly, no one is looking particularly excited at the prospect of carrying this one around. One Dahlia. Plus some XP. Seems like maybe we were intended to get nauseated there or something. But it's just a flower. But hey, that's uh 
That's three flowers. Now we're over halfway done. In theory. We're also out of... <laughs> out of places to explore. Um, that's not so good. So we've, we've checked all of this. So where else can we go? Um, I guess we have to go south. Hmm. Well, let's, yeah, let's go south. Let's just double check over here, I guess. Did I miss something here? Mm, doesn't seem like it. Um, hmm. Where else do you think? So this is going to take us back to, like, Ook Pier area. Is there anything over this way? Not really, no. So definitely I'm missing something. Well, we can... Maybe we should try something at that cliff. It's the only thing that I can think of. Um, Because aside from that, yeah, like I said, I think we've explored everywhere. Unless it, like, there's a way to climb and I don't know what it is. Just in, generally speaking. Maybe there'd be some other areas that we could try climbing. I don't know. But I think the cliff was over here. Okay, so let's let's just try. I mean, we got the wand. Let's let's try that. Nope. Let's try some of our other stuff here. Cable trolley. No, that'd be too easy. Uh, rubber bear. Who else has stuff? Let's see. Um, stone of gates. Stone of New Life. The Power Globe we could try, as well as the Tree and Brushes. That's really about it. We kind of clean, cleared our inventory out. We also have the, the shovel, I think. Yeah, no. <laughs> no surprise there. I think that was just used in um, Orc Ogre area. Well, let's try that. Nothing there. Uh, none of these are really going to do anything as far as I can guess. And you don't have anything. Somebody's got... There's that. And there is... That's it. Yeah. Okay, well, um... I guess... There's really nothing here. We uh, will have to... Turn around and go somewhere else. We can... Try a couple other paths, maybe, but like... I think we've kind of exhausted a lot of our options here. There's a way to go more kind of toward the north in a different direction, maybe? Um, or maybe we have to go around. Let's just take a look at the map again here. We have, I guess it's possible maybe some of the flowers are out that way. We go back, back across the river, and then into the woods there, maybe we'll come across something. That's kind of the only thing that I can think of off the top of my head here. So I guess let's try doing that, and we'll see, <laughs> we'll see if that gets us anywhere. Should be... Easy enough to get back. 
Um, although uh, I will take a look around here one more time just to make sure that I didn't miss any paths in the other areas. Just, uh, yeah, just before we leave. Oh, what do we got here? Just a bunch of Umpani. We'll take care of them. Okay, so we've made it back from uh, this area north of Oak Pier itself, all the way around to right about here. So we're not actually quite across the bridge yet. Um, we're right next to it, but there, it seems like maybe there's a little path that goes out this way. So uh, that is what we are going to attempt to check out now. See if there is, in fact, a path out there. If not, we'll cross the bridge and, uh, you know, we'll kind of go from there. Right, there is the river itself. So if we go this way, we end up with more river. Okay, let's take a look at the map again. So it seems like either way, we have to cross the river. Which is going to really put us in Witch Mountains, not in Pure Mountains. But since we're going this way, I guess we'll, we'll check it out and just see if we can't find a path back down uh, this, this way a little bit from Witch Mountains, maybe. Uh, it's the only thing I can think of. And then uh, on the way, you know, <laughs> if we don't find anything of terrible interest here, what we'll do, I think, is go back to that uh, that tree fight that I had a hard time with. Actually, we're, I think we'll actually go in the water here. See if maybe we can skip the bridge a little bit. Or I guess not the bridge, but the cable trolley situation. Oh, also, I, uh, I moved the diamond ring over to Alima because it seems like she gets attacked more often than Gertrude does. So, uh, she, perhaps she could make better use of the regeneration. Okay, moths. Just a couple. Um, we'll just, yeah, we'll just fight them real quick. Might need to do a quick stamina and we'll get across to the other side of the water here. It's a bit of an easier fight, though, so we're getting into easier territory, it seems like. Okay, yeah, just, uh, just a quick... Quick one of those on yourself. Maybe a quick one of those on yourself, just so we can get one more square going here. I guess it actually didn't take as much stamina as I thought it would. But we'll go ahead and rest up a bit. It's a bit of a roundabout way to get to where I'm, I'm going. I'm just curious if there's anything else on, on the side of the river that we were just on. Um, before we worry about crossing it and everything. Uh, in a more permanent basis. And then, ah. <laughs> Somebody mentioned, yeah, the way we asphyxiate these uh, these critters is we uh, we grab them and we, we toss them on the bank. <laughs> Asphyxiation, magic hands. <laughs> okay. Let's go ahead and uh, we'll just fight with some people, except for you, who I guess will do the asphyxiation. That should be fine. And uh, just in case, we'll do an angel's tongue for uh, the remainder. Yeah, we're going to have a few left here. Okay, I think we can handle this. Does kind of seem like maybe this uh, this waterway is going to go somewhere. I am curious, man. A lot of XP from the fish too. Oh well, <laughs> spoke too soon, I guess. Fair enough. All right. Well, we're gonna have to do 
do this old song and dance for a little bit here. Just have everybody stamina themselves a couple times, and that'll let us get back to the bank, hopefully. And then, I don't know, I guess, uh... We'll just explore the other side of the river, maybe? There's not really much else that I can think of to do, just as far as, like, getting the flowers. I guess maybe if we don't find anything, I'll have to go back and just see what, um... The uh, specific instructions were see if there was any hints other than Oak Pier Mountains. But I thought he said that that's where they would be. Uh, Shen Cheng or Shen 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 Cheng, <laughs> however it's pronounced, I don't know. Uh, you know what? Let me just do another one there just in case. Uh, okay. Nothing there. Whoop! Wasn't paying attention. Hang on. We can we can fix this. Boom, 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 boom. And then more stamina's. Should only need a, a couple more here, I think. Not if we keep getting cast like that though. There we go, that's a little better. Alright, almost done. I do wish Restful was a bit more effective for the, the cost. It would make life a little bit easier. But uh, you gotta do what you gotta do. Okay. Save the game. And, uh... There we go. Dry land. Let's go ahead and we'll rest. And then we'll just, I don't know, explore this little section of woods here. And uh, see where we end up. Alright, I guess we'll have a fight. How tough are the fights going to be? Probably not that tough. Could be acid birds, could be fire birds, but either way, there's only the three of them. And not even. These are just spectral ravens by the looks of it, so we're uh, more or less in the clear here. Here we go. Okay. Uh, I think we'll just do a quick one of those and be on our way. Well, this is definitely going somewhere. Where I have absolutely no idea, but hey, there's some mountains. That looks promising, right? <laughs> that looks promising. We did skip a path just behind us a little ways. The pointed spires of scowling black mountains loom upwards, towering into the sky, and you feel a sudden slight rush of both awe and ominous foreboding. Ooh. Okay. I'm interested. You got my attention? I think maybe if we kind of stay, stay to the southern paths over here, we'll be closer to Oak Pier type territory. Alright, these guys got to go. These guys got to go. Uh, you give me... Let me think. I'm going to sleep on those ones, and then give me... Let's just learn something here. Let's try an asphyxiation, see how that goes. It's a good start. That's less good. <laughs> now he buffs up, this is probably going to hurt a bit. God damn it. Of course, Nerd would be the one to get friggin' paralyzed when I'm trying to AoE everybody. Alright, we'll at least put some of them to sleep. So we've got one more to deal with here. Ah. 
Two more to deal with, I guess. Well, we got him. Okay, so we've got another group of the Luna Mothras here. Um, do you have Asphyxiate? You do. We'll have you try it instead. And you will put those ones to sleep, I hope. Just in case. A little more acid breath. Very annoying. Yeah, we can get the lower level ones with it, but it's not going to work on the ones that actually matter the most, unfortunately, it looks like. So I'll have to do uh, other spells. Seems like uh, the psychic magic works on them, so maybe Fenpo can do his um, sonic blast or whatever it is that, that hits them all. It's one option. Confusions, I guess, is, is fine, or even, even just the sleeps, honestly, work fine. Just was looking for an alternative way to take them out. Okay. Let's go ahead and get that paralysis sorted out here. I didn't quite get there. It's okay. Let's not have you do it, though. Let's try one more. And then cure your own poison. Okay, so how's uh, how's HP looking on people here? Let's just we got, got a decent amount of magic here. Um, yeah, we'll just do a couple uh, heals on people here and there. Not sure what happened there exactly. And maybe one on you real fast. Yeah, that's weird. Keep on. I don't know if I'm misclicking or what, but it's fine. Okay, we'll go with that. And be on our way. I'm not going to worry about buffs, I guess, right now. Because it doesn't seem like these fights are all that hard. There's a steep trail which leads up the mountain here. Okay, so we know we have a trail. We're going to remain down here for the moment. And um, I want to, to, before we take that path, I'm going to go all the way back. Let's just double check what's going on here as well. Oh, we get some giants, okay. Let's hide. These guys have a lot of HP, I think, so... Ooh. And they hit hard, as I guess <laughs> one might expect. Um, we'll fight with these guys. Let's let's just see. Let's try try some magic and just see what we can get to work on these guys. Uh, maybe like a ice ball. Maybe a... Uh, what do you think? Whipping rocks. And uh, we'll try the, the Poet's Loot as well. Okay. Moderate success with the uh, the Blinding Flash. Not so much with the Sleep. Ice Ball seems okay. Whipping Rocks, definitely not. Also kind of as expected. This next we could try, like, a Whirlwind or something just to see how that goes. If we get another round, we may not. So we'll just fight with everybody, uh, except for you. Let's have you just do... A... I actually don't have Whirlwind. Eh, how about a Stink Bomb? You have Whirlwind, don't you? No? Really? Surely. Somebody has a friggin' Whirlwind. Well, whatever. Oh, no, there it is. Yeah, okay. Let's try that. Let's see how far we get. Okay. Seems like air magic is okay. Alright, there we go. Nice amount of XP from those guys. And actually some like... As far as monsters go, some okay money. Ah, more bugs. Lots of bugs. Actually, you know what? 
And now let's we'll we'll do it with the slow way. I don't know. I was thinking about <laughs> casting in some AOEs, but we don't know what we're gonna find here. It seems like the fights are maybe a little bit harder. What with the giants and everything, so we're gonna conserve resources at least a little bit at first here. Okay, what are we gonna do? We're gonna we could if we wanted to. Do a little bit of AoE and just see how that goes. And then we'll just uh, do sleeps with everybody else, I guess. There we go, that makes life easier. And we make them all go insane. <laughs> Didn't actually hit very many of them, though. But it woke all, all of these guys up. So let's... Let's definitely finish... This group off. Before we do anything crazy here. And we get an Angel Stun going as well. I've never seen a, a weevil dance, but I'm sure it's it's entertaining. <laughs> okay, down the list we go. Okay, three groups left. This will be a quick one. Alright, boar weevils and then venom weevils and then tons of XP. I should be using the two wands I have left in my inventory too, but uh, I keep forgetting about them. Not really a big deal. If we have to, we can just drop them anyway, but if I, if I remember them, you know, I'll use them to see, see if we can get an extra skill point out of it for, uh, for Fenpo. Okay. So we get that, and then we get that. It's a little bit more down this way, though. Who knows where this leads? There's a steep trail which leads down the mountain here. Um, I have a theory where this is going to go. Let's remain here and save. <laughs> Didn't think that was going to happen. But uh, I saved. Climbed down. We skillfully navigate the treacherous climb, and we're actually steep trail which leads up the mountain here. Let's remain here for now, and we're yeah we're in a totally different place right now. Okay, I mean well we're here, so I guess we'll um we'll uh, just roll with it. In the pitted gorge of the mount. Uh, in the pitted gorge of the mountain beckons an elephantine cave, and you sense perhaps the abode of many a thumping Goliath. Maybe no one is home. Probably not going to be so lucky. Just in case, perhaps you do just a couple minor buffs here. Seems like a good idea. Just gonna refresh some stuff here. What do we got? 
So it looks like it's probably a cave of giants. Or sounds like it, anyway. Violating his dominion, you confront a strapping colossus. Hooah! Ogo gets new shoes! Any attacks. Lil Ogo, huh? How are you gonna get shoes if you can't find them? That's what I thought. And perhaps you do... Actually, you know, I want to try something here. Does anybody have the spell? Somebody, surely. Give me a deep a freeze. Give me a crush. Let's see how that goes. Ooh, we got him. Deep freeze not so good though. Well that was that was a fun use of magic <laughs> we never use. Well, he's definitely got some HP. Just a couple. Alright, well. Allow us to continue, I guess. Let's do one of those uh, real quick. We'll try uh, a Poet's Loot. I doubt that's going to do anything for us, but whatever. Oh, we got one of them to sleep. Uh, that's better than I thought. You see, it seems like he can't get through our armor, so that's good. Because I imagine if he did, it's probably going to hurt a lot. There's one. Okay. Whew. All right. Well, let's see if we can finish this guy off. Punching this guy in the ankles for whatever it's worth. Here we go. How much XP are we going to get for this? Quite a lot is the answer. Enough to get a Valkyrie level. Uh... Let's see here. Yeah, I guess we'll get some more climbing. Can't do anything with that, unfortunately. And what about here? Um, yeah, more, more crit. New Valkyrie spell. What do you, uh, what do you get? Hold monsters. That's that's what you get. You surmise that you are considered a delicacy in this neck of the woods. So it would seem. So he's blocking this direction. Okay, we got a beach. The large flowing body of water can only be an underground route of the Aran River winding its way down through the mountains. Very convenient for the inhabitants to have a fresh water supply as well as an easy means for disposing of waste. And meddlers. <laughs> like us? Um, looks like there is a patch of land over there. We'll uh, maybe explore that later. Oh boy. Frost giants, you say? Oh, good. They have frost breath, but they missed us. I guess because we were all hidden at the time. Maybe. Perhaps. Go ahead and do that. Let's go ahead and do... Uh, we'll try that. See if it works any better on frost giants over forest giants. Crit is nice. Uh, yeah. I didn't think that was going to work, but it was worth a shot. Probably better with the angel's tongue, or maybe even chromatic liar on these guys. Probably Angel's Tongue is better. With uh, Chromatic Liar as a backup. And worth a decent amount of XP. 
They don't seem to be too difficult to take down. Ah. So I guess we're just committing giant genocide, huh? Oh ho ho! Little jelly tubes. Well, they don't seem very nice. Gruengard. Ooh, he got he got he got magic though. He's making us itchy before we can make him itchy. It's alright, we can handle that. I think yeah, you fight with him, I think you silence. Like so. Let's use that. Silence may not work on him. I guess we'll see. It's entirely possible that we may have... Oh, good, it did work. Um, it's entirely possible we may have, like, bypassed a route <laughs> that would have let us come through here peace peacefully if we had taken the road or whatever forest instead of the river. But, uh, you know, that's how the cookie goes sometimes. Like, it uh, reminds me of uh, one of the Fallout games. I took, like, the back way into somewhere. And, uh, you know, the residents of the area were understandably upset about that. And uh, tried to kill me, so I had to kill all of them. Come to find out later that if I had gone in the front door, I could have had a conversation and actually, like, gotten quests and stuff. <laughs> Oops. Maybe I should have taken this a little more seriously. Thought these would be a little bit lower level ones, but uh, these seem to be kind of nasty. Last one, I think, maybe? Yes, okay. Even those are worth a couple XP. Can't complain about that. Let's see if level 3 is enough. It is not. So maybe we'll try level 4 with you and just see if that gets it in one shot here. It does. Okay. We could also use maybe a little bit of a rest. But uh, I think we'll call it here. Excuse me. As I was about to say, I think we'll maybe call it here for now. Let's just fight these guys, I guess. And then, I don't know, can we kill these with whipping rocks and maybe psionic fires? No, not quite. Well, sort of. Yeah, I mean, if I were to cast those on the same group, they'd all be dead. Or mostly be dead. Don't think we're hitting quite everyone in the group with those spells, but... Um, they're sufficiently weak and we should be able to take care of this pretty easy. I guess if I was going to do a level whatever Sonic Fires, I could have just done a level 2 nuke for almost the same amount of... Magic anyway, and hit like everybody pretty much. Okay, a little poison. Ow. Seems they're hitting us awfully frequently now. Alright, what's left? Alright, let's take out these guys. And, uh... Let's just try a level 1 nuclear blast and see if that gets us anywhere. It does. All right, what do we got? One left, one left. Why are there alien jellyfish in this cave to begin with? That's what I want to know. All right, decent amount of XP there. Hey, we got a ninja level to close things out. I guess we'll take it. Have some sword, have some uh, additional climbing, I guess. Have some firearms. 
have some. Uh, I guess I was even uh, going to give you a mythology. And a ranger level. My, my, my. Okay, uh, I think, was I giving you mythology as well? Your Kirijitsu is maxed out. No, I was giving him, uh, yeah, like, Theosophy in case I changed his, um, class at some point. Anyway, yeah, I'm gonna get people sorted out here. We'll probably do a little bit of, uh, resting. And then, uh, after that, I guess we will continue to explore ourselves what appears to be some giant caves. One more person poisoned here. Seems like this place is pretty big, not even in the sense of, like, giants, but in the sense of just, uh, spaces to explore. So, seems like we, uh, we may very well have our work cut out for us here.